as the juice jingle from the hot young and single little stunt. A 40 in the blunt? That's all she really wants. But she'll spend your paper and she'll use it for your plastic. And if you swing the F, you better wear a prophylactic. Cause things are getting drastic. Slide up in the wrong one, you end up in the casket. Sister, there's no need in speeding. She was doing lays before she started bleeding. What makes a bitch wanna act in this fashion? Pulled more stunts than my man Axon Jackson. The dubstep shit, like, you know what I mean? I know how it goes. This is different to be rhyming over it, you know what I mean? But that's what I think they need to bring to it, too. You know what I mean? Forward thinking. See, if radio was more open, dubstep been would have been infused into hip-hop a long time ago. Because if you think about back in the Art. days, how the fuck we got up on craft work and all that type of yeah. shit? You understand what I'm saying? It's the same fucking thing. And we may have routines to numbers. It's the same shit. It's just slowed down. Like, think of this as craft work slowed down. Yep. You know what I mean? Like, that's what the fuck it is, man. Yep. What attracted me to dubstep was the bass. I always love heavy bass and hip hop, reggae, you know what I mean? And like, first, the first dubstep song that I really noticed and, uh, you know, was really feeling the bass and it was crazy. And I was just like, what is this? You know what I mean? And, and that's what really drew me into uh, dub stuff. Some music gets you hyped, some music makes you think, you know, you know, some music makes you want to punch somebody in the face, you know, that rah-rah feeling, like, you know? And, um, and dub stuff gives you that too, you know? It has, some of those songs give you that real rah-rah, like, yeah, you know? Let's have a mosh pit or something, you know? Go crazy.